I was relieved. Um, I, as I've said before, humbly and respectfully, I've never gotten into a race without the expectation of winning. And so um, I've had success in my last six races. And um, this being my seventh, I was just relieved that we got to um, got to another victory. I am I am excited and when people ask about you know whether I consider myself progressive or a moderate what I like to describe myself as a humble public servant um, when people are asking for food assistance or rental assistance or how to get their hands on a PPP loan they never end the calls with and oh by the way are you a moderate or a progressive they're generally very appreciative that they have someone that is willing to help them get the resources and the results that they're looking for so I, I don't ascribe to any of the labels I am a I am a proud Democrat who works tirelessly for the people who are trusting me to make decisions on their behalf. I don't think this race was decided by money. I think it was decided by the people who deliver results and um, people who are willing to work and really willing to work collaboratively. This is a, a sport by addition, not subtraction. And so when you have friends and you're able to, to work with others, I think that proved to be a successful formula to get me to this place called victory. I think there's certainly some um, room for other voices at the table for sure. And so I think that, you know, I'm, I've been hyper focused on trying to find that common ground. Where can we meet together so that we can um, make progress? That's been my focus. So I'm not one that looks for um, the dividing point, but really looking for the uniting point. This was a, a this was a battle. It came down, you know, it started out with um, 13 folks. There were me and 12 other people on the ballot and it came down to two dynamic women. But what I want people to know is now there is um, there's one I've become the Democratic nominee. And so I am respectfully, humbly requesting that those who didn't um, vote for me in the primary consider joining forces so that we can, you know, win in November. And, you know, I take nothing for granted. I think that getting together, working together, uniting is what the world and really what this country is looking for. And that was proven um, last night. So no more divisiveness, no more polarizing. Let's get together so we can get things done.